Hello and welcome to the production car challenge. We are in the Mazda and we are at Watkins Glen and I'm excited because I love this place. Love Watkins Glen, such a good track. And I don't think I've ever been here in the Mazda. I could be wrong, but it feels different. It doesn't feel like uh, something I've done before. And it's so much fun, love this track. Um, especially, you know, after the update, um, some of the uh, track limits aside that are a little bit questionable sometimes. Uh, it looks great. I like the new curbs. And uh, I think hopefully it should be a good race. One thing I am a little concerned about is we're just going to ease through here for now on this early lap as the car still got cold tires. It's just a warm-up lap anyway. Um, one thing I'm a little concerned about is maybe draft will play too big of a role here. I'm hoping that's not the case. If, I'm thinking we should be able to break away. There's enough corners that can make it possible, but uh, the must is maybe just a tiny bit slow for this place. So you can kind of get uh, draft keeping people up with you that maybe shouldn't. As I got sideways there. These darn cold tires warm up already. Need these things warm before my first lap. But I just I hope I just get to do all the laps, because I think it'll be a lot of fun. We are the number four. Um and I think three of the m number three of the Mazdas, I, I think. I'll have to look at it again. But uh unfortunately small number, but Kind of getting used to that on the roadside now as well. Um, it doesn't seem like too many high rank guys do a lot of the series I do, I guess. That's what I'm coming to understand. I don't know. It could just be the times that I'm racing to. Although right now it's not necessarily like late in the day or anything. It is 8.30. So, I don't know. Wish I wasn't the number four overall, but it's what it is. So, I'm not going to be able to hit my all-time best, I don't think, because I think it was uh, aided by draft in the practice session ahead of time. So you'll see we go from 0 .01 right now, because we had a pretty good first corner. But I think it's going to start bleeding off here in a moment. Although, I did take the fuel out. I did remember to do that for once here, so maybe that's uh, evening it out. Kind of messed that up a little bit, but it's still pretty fast. I love going through there. I love going through that bus stop. It's so much fun. Just flying through there. <laughs> oh no, I never drove that. Hopefully bring it back a little bit here. The runoff. No, basically not at all. Well, that was an awful corner. Make sure I don't overdrive that next time. Oh man, now I'm getting on the curb. I'm throwing this lap away. Alright. Try to be smoother next lap, I guess. Get what we can here. Hopefully it's not too bad. Kind of missed my marks on a couple of corners. That's going to hurt the lap time. You got about five laps of fuel left. You've got about five laps of fuel. Okay, thank you. You just told me that. Not very uh, useful information in qualifying, actually. Once again, feeling great with uh, the Majors Garage free baseline plus. Doing great work for me. Very happy with it. I can't imagine what their other ones are. How they could be faster, because I'm usually plenty competitive 
with their free setup. I don't even know what else they would do for you, but <laughs> I don't plan on finding out. I don't really want to pay for stuff. Took it a little easy through there, but uh, just didn't want to mess it up. Don't overdrive this this time. Yes. Okay, that's better. I will be happy if I can match my all-time best. That'd be great. You can see going up this hill <laughs> with less fuel in it. I, I wonder if that has a lot to do with the fact that it has less fuel because you're not lugging all that heavy fuel up the hill. I wonder if that has something to do with uh, why that little burst of speed game. Where did my all-time best go? I was looking at that. Messed up the exit of that corner, too. That stinks. Well, there you are. Decided to come crawling back, huh? <laughs> Not sure what that was about. I guess this is fine. 209.304 was the first lap, and 209.0. A couple people faster than this. I guess I should not be surprised. Because I didn't quite get that perfect. It's four tenths off my best. I don't know what happened to the session best lap there. It kind of threw me off a little bit because it was gone. But, uh,. Let's see, we got all the Mustangs ahead, as expected, with these long straightaways for them to show their power. And then fourth of the Mazdas at the moment. Man, even if I got my best, I would still be half a second off the lead, guys, so we're going to have our work cut out for us. But it should be a fun race. I think it'll be a lot of fun. Optimal's 2080, so if I were to get my act together and put it all together, then I would have had a qualifying uh, or a pull lap. That's easier said than done. I don't even think I can e say it very easy. <laughs> Current best. Ooh, I'm looking at the other side of the screen. I'm glad it kicked me out when it did. <laughs> I was looking at the standings. So, yeah. Best is a 2086. So that would have had me second, third. Right there. So that's fine. Let me make sure I remember to put my fuel back. It was here before. And uh, let's not forget we got to survive not only the first lap, but pacing as well. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, it's because not, <laughs> not everyone's joined in yet. I was like, wow, that, uh, Jetta, I think it would be <laughs> very close. I didn't really look at how many we had of the other uh, classes, but it looks like not too many. Mostly Mazdas, but a nice, uh, actually, you know what? Mostly Mustangs, it kind of looks like. Well, no. Both a lot of Mustangs and both a lot of Mazdas. So that's cool. At least it's not just Mazdas. We'll see if they leave a gap to the Mustangs. I don't know how necessary it would be because I think they're clearly faster. Maybe we just don't want to catch them into turn one. So maybe they'll leave a little bit of space. Plus, if they crash, that's kind of the main thing they leave the space for us. If there's a crash, we're not coming up right behind it. Shouldn't be too long now. We'll get started. I gotta remember to be a little more cautious on the initial couple laps as the tires are cold. This thing's not as deadly as some of the other setups have been in the past on cold tires, like the uh, Charlotte Roval setup. That thing was evil. Very fast, but very, very scary to drive on cold tires. 
This one not so much, but you do still have to watch out. Sure. So, everyone's joined up. Looks like the uh, Mustangs are about to start rolling. And we'll see what our Mazdas are going to do. Looks like we're going to leave a gap. Alright. So, inside of the lane I'm in, should be the uh, control lane because of the clockwise direction of Watkins Glen. I'm gonna try to get the tires warm a little bit. Brakes as well. Tupac did get pull, right? Yeah, so he should be on. He should be on the uh, this lane, right? Am I losing my mind? I might be. Two should be the control car. Hmm. Oh, maybe it's because of the way the Mustangs were lined up. Maybe they. That side? I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. At the end of the day, I'm still an oval racer. <laughs> Plenty of gap. I really don't think we need to give this much of a gap. Brendan, get out of the baby car, bro. What are you violating that thing for? Stings are crowding pace car, it sounds like. I feel like we should be getting the tires up uh, to temp a little bit here. Just doing this little pace lap. And like I said, it's not too huge of a deal. It didn't feel like it to me anyway. Driving on the cold tires, so I'm not too concerned about it. I'll still be careful though. Long race. Let me start before too long, so make sure I'm up on this one. About to go green, stay focused. There we go. Your race car is off, time to do your job. Let's go. Green flag, green flag. Always weird starts here, I swear. But, uh, okay. Good. Get line. Right side. Here's we will be getting dive bombed already. Clear. Clear. Wait, one Clear. corner. Still there. Stay on the left. Plenty of room. Clear. This isn't going to be good, is it? Alright, we're fine, we're fine. Cool. I was really worried how that was going to go. I was afraid we were going to get hit from behind, or the guy was going to break way early in front of us. I did not know what to expect there, but... Alright, we're fine. That went about as well as it could have. Car on the right. Car on the right. It's the gonna right. be a Mustang, I bet. Yep. Okay. Slowed down a little extra more because it said slow car on the right, so make sure I could navigate it if I needed to, and 
left take guard. care of. Clear on the left. Trying to dive bomb that guy, he just took some weird way wide turn. It's just way off the racing line. Car on the left. Uh oh, still going to left. Okay, we're good. I was worried where that was going to be. So, some trouble for the Mustang so far. Must have seemed okay. Oh, that? that guy's damaged. I see. Or not. Just very slow, maybe. Oh boy, and now we got people blinking out a very bad time. This could get hairy. Fucking Mustang man, speed up! Yes, this is scary. Staying in the way, right in the middle of our Mazdas. Wants. Not trying to pass here. A long shot. Just had to take that easy. Can't attack it like I want. With people in front of me. This Mustang is a problem. Right up in the middle of this battle for the lead and these mosses. <laughs> He's all over the track, too. He's just not holding a line. Really checked up through here. Alright. Still there, hold your line. Clear. Take that guy. Nicely done. I believe that puts us in fifth. They're all kind of right in front of us. Kind of how I feared. I think Draft is playing a big part here. You're in fear. I guess the Mustang's taking a defensive line into turn one. I don't know what's going on with that guy? He really needs to just get out of the way or something. It's it's awkward because obviously he's faster on the straights, but I think he doesn't have the talent to get away with the, from the like from the Mazdas in the corner. And so he's just stuck right here, and it's really a problem. No offense, Mustang man. I think you need to uh, work on improving your lap time in practice. I just everyone's checking up at another bus, bus stop, so you can't hit it as fast as you want to. That's causing uh, everyone to get stacked on each other too. But yeah, there's no reason the Mustang should be as slow as the Mazas. Wheel on the desk. B5. Just be patient, because we got a lot of time still. guy off. It looked like some one of the Mazas was about to hit the wall. I guess they they didn't quite do it. They looked like they were offline. I was kind of scared for a moment. I couldn't see what was happening. 
Okay, it goes a little wide, but no harm done, really. Stay close. Keep the pressure. Got a pass attempt going on up there. Sectors one and three are looking quick. Sector two is zero one two eight off the face. Yeah, this is looking real drafty. I'm going to actually avoid passing anyone through here because I think we're just going to end up side by side. Like that in front of us. <laughs> it's just going to be bad for everybody involved, so. Almost an off drive there. But I avoided that. Catching up behind again. Hold your nerve, just keep it smooth, no mistakes. I, just, I know I'm so much faster than these guys, I'm just stuck here. Maybe not all of them. Maybe they're just all stuck as well. You know what I mean? Like, so it's uh, Come on, find all We're stuck together is all. It goes wide there again. Alright, we are ending. Pack Milner. We might have some engine ja engine damage now because he's slow. I think we have to get by the six. I think he's got damage on the front end and that's slowing him down on the straights. It's not huge, but it looks like it's enough that we're going to want to get by him now. Awkward angle into there, but we got it done. All right, we got past him. That's good. So let's catch up to these guys. We're moving forward slowly. You're back in fourth position. A couple of potential off tracks there. Can't go over the curb there anymore. It'll give you a 1x, so. See, we got the damage on the back of the green car there. I'm not sure that's going to slow him down much. He 
We can we take this like we want to this time. Ah, that's so fun. All right. <laughs> Good stuff. Yo, Anthony. Let's not fight. Let's try and get them. So we're here. I'm hoping we can pull away from the guys behind, but we'll see about that. Uh, oh, I overdrove that pretty bad. Had a lot of speed because of all the draft I was getting, I think, and that hurt me. Um, because I wasn't uh, factoring that in to how I was taking that corner. So. Yeah, good. Also, I think the tires are just losing grip. I feel like we're using them up, maybe. That's probably just me, though. I think we have more pace than these one over take. We're here though, we're in the draft. That's what we need. Got some uh, draft breaking going on there, it looks like, by the leader. Your lap time was 208.85. Way wide out there. Definitely off track that time. Oh, we got problems behind us. So now we got a second and a half. I like it. <laughs> Sucks for uh, who had trouble, but I like having no pressure behind. We'll stay in this draft, and if we can keep it clean, I think we're guaranteed a top four. Give him plenty of space through there, even though I could take that harder. Because, one, uh, it's riskier to take it harder. I don't think it's necessary with the draft. And two, you don't know if they're going to have stack up problems in front of you, and you don't want to be the first one to meet their rear bumper. Although, in this green car's case, we would not be the first one, we would be the second one. <laughs> so, um, just, I mean, you, you can see we're right back there. We're right back to him. So, there's no need to, uh, push it as hard as possible through there. Uh, it's, it's just known when to push, I think, is very important. So I could try to go up and make crazy passes and get the lead now, but they're just gonna follow me right in my footsteps because of the draft, I think. Just gotta wait for my moment. Ten minutes remaining. Ten minutes. Ooh, we're a little wide there, but you do get a little bit of runoff that part of the track, thankfully. Rail stacked up on each other. So he's gonna have to break a little earlier here, because they're side by side. Be ready for that. More than respectful, Burrow. That is. The gap behind is now 1.5. Hmm. <laughs> Overtake me on the track. He decided he was closing the door, and he almost stuck his foot, his big toe. Every now and then I try. <laughs> That's uh. It's fine. Just rolling reason to do anything else. Although that number one is getting away a little bit, that is a little bit concerning. So don't want that. Two takes that corner very soft for some reason. Maybe he was, maybe the green card did. He was just a, uh, Part of the accordion effect. I 
They're starting to catch again behind, so we need to get moving here. <laughs> yeah, on the curve a little bit there. I had to balance it for a moment. We're good. Very insistent on breaking the draft. Just don't want to lose that one. So if we could focus on that. Great. It is weird taking that corner so soft because it's not what I'm used to. So you can kind of get a little off off rhythm. These guys take this corner really soft. What the deal is there? Does pushing work? <laughs> I wouldn't. Sorry. Slow car on They're the left. Pushing. Slow car on the left. Uh oh. Well, maybe. We can try. P4. This is concerning. Oh my god. What are you doing, man? We got another Mustang mucking it up. Keep to the left. Clear on the right. Oh, good. Yeah, let's blink too. That's bad enough. Oh my God. Come on, Michael. Sector 1 time's okay. Sector 2 is 0.9 off the pace. Sector 3 is 0.8 off the pace. Five minutes remaining, five minutes left. I don't want to pass, I want to catch up to these guys. Speed up, Mustang man, man, I'll get out the heck out of the way. <sighs> Remember, the two breaks really early into this one, and plus, we got the Mustang in the way. Good lord, man. We gotta get past this Mustang, man. What a headache. What is he even racing for? There's no one around him. He's clearly made a mistake. He's not near anybody. Shift him, of course, there. Come on, find a way Red around. We're losing time. Still there. Push. We might get third here. Clear. Nice one, Colton. Good pass. Nice front. Oh, 
Oh my god, this Mustang. Come on, Mustang. Time to get defensive, mate. You're now awesome in stuff, third. Mate. Keep it coming. P3, you've just done a 210, like 5 1. So we've lost the leader because of all this, it looks like. We were patient for the two, but now he's not going to be patient for us. Still there. Clear on the left. Getting off track. Track limits. Watch those lines. Car on your left. Ridiculous. Still there. Still there. Clear on the left. Two minutes to go. Two minutes. Right side. Clear on the right. Gonna fuel. I noticed the fuel light blinking. I really would like this guy to work together with me here. All right. Clear. Right side. Okay. Clear on the right. Forget trying to catch the leaders then. Right side. Uh, don't panic. Stay on the left. Clear. So I do what you're unable to do and pass the Mustang. And now you're just going to take it right back before I can have a chance to get my bearings, and so we'll fight for third and just forget getting a better spot. Okay. You got about five laps of fuel left. White flag, white flag. E4. Right side. Clear on the right. Car right. Stay on the left. Still there, hold your line. Oh. Stay on the left. Clear. Right side. Clear. I got cut right down. Okay, got a penalty for cutting the core. You'll need to give back the time gained. Well, I sure hope that bleeds off. Left side. Well, we Still got it off, but now we uh, had to do all that. Stay on the right. Not doing three fight. Still there. Hold your line. Clear on the left. Okay. Defensive line. That's something I learned recently. Start doing defensive lines. You'll get dive bombed less. I think that's what helps me do that. I think he would have probably stuck his nose in there otherwise. Alright. Well, I'll be honest. I feel like we could have competed for the win here. But. You got a Mustang migraine. <laughs> but it still finished third, so that's okay. Well done, Colton. Great drive. That's a pretty good way. Is that guy gonna be mad? Hey, Redman. Good job. I'm gonna drive hey, away. Good job. <laughs> In case he is. Until uh, everyone's finished. Why not? Uh... Good race, guy. Okay, he's not bad. Yeah, good race. That was intense. A lot of fun. 
Yeah, Mustang avoided spell. <laughs> yeah, that, just, that sure stirred the pot, that's for sure. <laughs> yep, yep. <laughs> Alright, so we got Podium, that's cool. I'm glad that guy was a good sport about everything. Uh, that last lap uh, side by side through the bus stop was certainly scary, and I had to be aggressive. But we were able to do it, so that was cool. And, uh, alright. Good stuff. We finished third. We got, what, 2x? Yes, 2x. Each of them an off track. I'm cool with that. Kept the car clean, as far as I know. Well, maybe had some mud on it, but you know what I mean. <laughs> uh, we'll uh, check out the incidents then. So here's uh, some of these early Mustang problems. I just couldn't get it turned, and then I remember he was uh, sitting there when we came on by. And there's a spin. Red slow car on the left. Thankfully, he was out of the way. Still causing some problems, though, for the Mazdas as they come through. It's just a barely little tap of the wall. Is that rear ending we saw in front of us? I think that damaged this guy's car. It did seem like he was missing a little bit of speed afterward, but uh, what really hurt him was doing that and losing all the momentum there, which allowed us to get around. Sting all alone. Ah, that's a fake hit. That wasn't real. Ooh, white and blue. Mazda kind of came in and hit that guy. Mm. Real need for that there. I could have just stayed back and drafted. And they just kind of get into each other. Don't think you need to be trying to pass right there. Oh man, this guy almost makes it through, but just gets tapped enough to get sent around. Ooh, close call there. Looks like everyone makes it through after that. Rear ending through the corner. But his, his Mazda might be broken after his damage. Didn't look like a normal spin. Oh, wow. He blew his engine. I did not realize that happened. So that damage affected him much more than I even expected. His engine explodes from uh, temps. That's crazy, unless he just downshifted one extra time. He gets out of the way pretty good. It's going to be a wall on exit here, it looks like. Guys having a lot of trouble getting this thing turned. The Jetta, never saw him the whole race. I don't think we lapped anybody. Wants to go in for an adventure. Gotta get off the gas if you're gonna be cutting like that, or else the grass is gonna get you crazy unsettled. Now suddenly, we're getting passed by two people. Here's this Mustang that was a huge headache for us. Can't imagine why. So it's his own mistakes that put him back here, and then he just wants to be right in the middle of our battle for the lead, despite being... not even in contention up there. There's no need for that. We're seeing that. I guess hit the curbs a little hard or something. Ooh, maybe clipped that uh, 
wall there just a bit. Still having trouble turning this uh, Mustang, and that might be the last time they have trouble doing it. Looks like probably just some uh, curb again. Loose out of that corner. I think, is that race over? Yeah, I believe so. I want to go back and look at that uh, last lap between me and the two. I want to see how close we were to each other during the bus stop portion. So we're in the position to get the draft here. And at this point in the race, you've got to take it. Though I probably could have waited. I probably could have done that a little bit. I don't know. Let's see how close we were here. Do this half speed because it's going to happen fast. So neither of us are going to back out. He gives plenty of room. I give plenty of room. I give too much room, probably. Because uh, I get loose. end up cutting a little bit. But uh, I'd rather cut than run into him. So that wasn't uh, quite as close as I thought it was. I didn't plan on cutting like that. I obviously don't want to do that and give myself one I stand to slow down. I just... Uh, I didn't think we were going to make it through the second half if I didn't do that. And uh, I got loose too, so I just, uh, instead of trying to turn the wheel back to the right too much and overcorrect it and hit him or something, I kind of just went with it. Got myself my slowdown, and thankfully we were able to overcome it. So we drag through here pretty good, we have a better angle. And then I choose to take my uh, slowdown by slowing down a little early for that corner and then protecting the inside on exit and he kind of has to slow up for me and then I've got the defensive line going through here I'm so thankful <laughs> to this blue Mazda we're not taking it three wide is he still in here? no I mean I've been here for a long time but I want to thank him we're not taking that three wide. It wasn't going to work. So. And you know, the tube was very kind as well. Give plenty of room. Some good racing here today. I was able to just push it hard enough to get in front of him. And then I took my defensive line because I knew he was forced to be on the inside anyway. He didn't make a dumb move forcing it or anything. I think we got a nice group here. That was very fun. And uh, able to stick the bottom and actually get through there pretty well because they were side by side, I guess. And uh, that's all we needed to get on through and get ourselves our bronze medal. So that's awesome. All right, that was a lot of fun. Watkins Glen, still stand by it. Very, very fun track. And uh, so we will finish ninth overall, third in the Mazdas. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I had a lot of fun. And uh, I hope to see you again soon. Have a good one.